And now the 62 National Council on Health kicked off yesterday in the Federal Capital Territory within deliberation to review status and state of healthcare system in Nigeria. It focused primarily on improving universal health coverage initiative in Nigeria. The Health Council being the highest policy-making organ in the health sector sole commissioners, directors and permanent secretary from the 36th state of the Federation and the FCT preferring ways to achieve successful universal health coverage initiative in the country. Benedict Oko has more this report. At the opening ceremony of the 63rd National Council on Health, the Minister of Health, Usagi Ehaniri, represented by Permanent Secretary Mahmouda Maman, urged the participants to come up with formidable health care policies and recommendations that would assist the federal government in further improvement in the health sector. Our objective is to see how we can be able to strengthen the primary health care. Because if we strengthen the primary health care structure in Nigeria, universal health coverage will be attained with a minimal cost at all levels of government. Responsibility at this juncture is to make the policies, okay? But when it comes to the implementation segment of it, it cuts across all the segments, the federal, the state, and the local government. But what we do is we strategize, we set up a special, I mean, council monitoring committee to interface with states and find out what are their challenges, and then we try to mitigate to make sure that at least they also achieve reasonably I mean, uh, uh, the implementation status of all the council resolutions. The Director of Health Plans, Research and Statistics, Ngozi Azonobi, laid emphasis on policies yet to be implemented and the need to do so. The previous meetings have been very, very good, successful and useful. Um, uh, have we implemented them as effectively as we should? Some of them we have, others we haven't. And uh, there are many reasons and challenges and so what this council is also doing is to review how well we've done with previous implementation and you will see that presented you know uh, at the council we'll do a scorecard for ourselves that's what i'm saying so and the scorecard always shows us where where we missed it and what we can do differently the director of research planning and permanent secretary federal capital territory administration ibrahim abubaka and abubaka tafida drew the attention of participants to the recurring challenges and deliberate action in addressing them the fct administration is making concerted efforts in providing the desired structures and resources needed to build an effective health system that will guarantee positive health outcomes and the attainment of the universal health coverage in the FCT. One of the 13 point mandate of the FCT administration is to establish a mandatory universal health insurance scheme. For the FCT administration, building an effective healthcare delivery system, improving health outcome and providing health cover for residents of the territory is our priority. To this end, the present FCT administration is committed to the provision of qualitative, affordable, and accessible health care services to its people. The representative of the World Health Organization, Mayor Okamula, said that the theme for the conference aligned with the WHO agenda in improving the health sector in Africa. She called all stakeholders in Nigeria to accelerate their efforts in improving the health sector in the country. It is heartwarming to note that the theme and sub-themes of this National Council on Health reflect the above WHO priorities in the extended GBW13 and the transformation agenda of the African region. Accordingly, the WHO as a member state organization will depend on the strategic guidance of the health sector plan which will be enriched by the outcomes of this National Council of Health to translate this into Nigeria country cooperation strategy, even as we advance efforts toward 2024-25 program budget. The theme for the meetings is building a resilient and suitable health system to improve health outcome and universal health coverage in Nigeria. The four-day engagement is expected to come up with policies and recommendations in the advancement of the healthcare system.